I think this Giants and Lions game in New York on Sunday is fantastic. It's loaded with playoff implications with both teams at 9-4. and four. And I believe this, the, and not enough people are talking about it, the Detroit Lions could easily lose out. They've got the Cowboys in Week 16 and the Packers Week 17. That hits home the importance for Detroit on Sunday. Matthew Stafford is going to play, but I'm concerned. His middle finger is a mess. Stafford has torn ligaments, and he dislocated a digit. That's kind of a huge deal when, you know, you're throwing a football. Stafford has been brilliant this year. He's in my top four for league MVP. The Lions would be nothing without him. That's why this injury cannot be downplayed. Detroit has won a lot of games based upon Stafford's fourth quarter magic and brilliance. The stats on the screen, legit. Sunday is going to be tough with the injury. Weather is going to be a huge factor in New York. And let's be honest, would have even been a tough game for Matthew Stafford and Detroit with the way the Giants were playing on defense. Steve Spagnuolo deserves so much credit, so much credit. The way he and Ben McAdoo have run this defense, it, it's been incredible. The team flew around against Dallas, and they did it without JPP, and they won that game. And I was dead wrong, absolutely dead wrong. And I thought the defense was just amazing. And Janoris Jenkins playing sensational football at the cornerback position. And, you know, I love what we've seen from Steve Spagnuolo dialing up pressure. It has been incredible. And the Lions' offensive line is weak and theoretic, not expected to play. Listen, is doubtful at the running back position. But you know what makes this game even more fascinating? The Giants offense. I don't trust Eli Manning and the Giants offense at all on Sunday, even against a suspect Detroit defense, albeit one that is very well coached. Eli Manning has his knack for throwing the football to the other team. That's a problem. If you have a stat in yellow on time to shine, that's bad news. Oh, by the way, you can't trust the Giants offensive line or run game or receivers not named Odell or frankly, can't trust Odell to focus. Did I mention Eli Manning throwing it to the other team? Look, I think the Giants are better than Detroit with Stafford compromise and both teams need to bank wins down the stretch. I really don't trust Eli Manning this season at all, but I really don't trust Matthew Stafford against the Giants defense without all of his fingers.